and what up ladies and gentlemen speedrun is here and today let's learn how to set up browedit 3 you go to the link in the description below and download your browedit 3 patcher create your folder browedit 3 add the patcher inside launch it now you have few options here what you want to do first is go to the latest one on the top and hit OK. That will download all the application that you need to launch ProEdit. Pretty easy. Thank you, Borf. You made it so convenient for all of us. Great. Now our ProEdit is launched. We will do a few setups and go back to the patcher. Now we can choose our RO path. That's where I installed my server, uh, the offline server. And my one, it's in the D drive. And you can see down here, Ragnarok Online and the client. Inside the client, you have these kind of folders, right? And the GRFs. So you open that one. That's the path I use. And here is the GRF files. Um, I link data.grf, which is, let me copy this path, I'll be going back here, and my data.grf is in, in the D drive, yeah. and Ragnarok Online, then here I have um, client, and data okay now i will add once more here on this button here and click browse and i choose our data and you can add as many other grfs that you like um, here is the teams and you have four options the light classic and tark uh, if you don't know, Tark is the one to create all these beautiful icons and designing um, some stuff here in Brow Edit 3. So I choose dark. I like to stick to this skin. And down here, um, let me see. Yeah, that's up here is all good. GRF editor, you browse. If you have installed on the default location, it will find automatically. You just hit OK. And here we have our path. Now, this FFmpeg path, it's basically uh, something necessary for you to render videos in Brow Edit 3. We will add later on. So now I just hit save. And we can already launch maps. For example, I'll go here, File New, and create a new map. Or I go to File and Open, and open any map that I want. OK, it's all working perfectly. <clears throat> and you can play around with this for now, if you want. And I will close to finish setting up. Let me show you something before closing. If I go down here in effects, you can see that there are no preview. They all look the same. Let's set up that as well. So now I close. Uh, we can use this patcher right here, but for the effects, I find out I have to use the patcher generated by this patcher right here. For example, FFmpeg, it's all good. I just hit download and we'll be good to go. It's very fast, so I'll just uh, wait this finish. And I will try actually to download defects through this option. Now it's graded out. 
I'll just hit OK first. It's going to launch here. Uh, so you go to Edit, and here you have Global Settings. You can also hit Ctrl P. And down here, we're going to link our FFmpeg. And I have my one in the Brow Edit folder. It downloads here. And now here, with this, we can make videos inside Brow Edit. Will be one of the topics in my tutorials. I hit save, and it's all good. Now we still cannot review the effects. And I'll try to use this patcher first. Uh, it's downloading. Let's see if it downloads really. I still cannot see it here. Oh, this time it happens uh, all good. So we have downloaded the effects. If by any chance this doesn't download it, you can try using the patcher generated by Brow Edit 3. And okay, now we have the effects. That's all we need. We can close this. Uh, you don't need to extract or anything. So now I can open Brow Edit 3. And let's preview our uh, effects as well. File, open. And I'll open our Prontera here. I can go to Edit or actually Object Mode. It's hidden down here, Effects. And now you can see that those effects that are possibly able to add in games will be showing here. Uh, it might take some time to load. You can see it's bugging a bit. But it's all good. It's a heavy file. And yes, uh, now it's loaded. I can, for example, pick this. But you will see that in-game or in the editor, uh, better saying, right? You can see that still showing this, which is normal. You can open maps and copy effects from the maps. This map doesn't have any effect. I cannot see it. But if you go to another map that has effect, you can simply copy and bring to the map. This will be a subject for our next video uh, in the near future. I do appreciate you all uh, watching and learning here with me. Enter Brow Edit Discord. Like this video, subscribe to this video. I will be bringing all kinds of content related to this beautiful editor. It's a speed run here and see you in the next video.